What's going on, everybody here, and welcome back to some more Planet Crafter. So, in the last episode, we worked on getting our brand new fancy ore extractor tier three, as you can see it right over there, and uh, getting some more drones set up, getting basically everything going here, trying to trying to expand everything, get some rockets shot up. But um, yeah, we are back, and today we're hopefully gonna be focusing on fish. <laughs> the fish is gonna be the content of this video, hopefully. Um, but before we get into that, I did want to mention that I did forget we can craft our own pulsar quartz now. When we unlocked it, we had we we added the ability to craft it. So osmium, zeolite, iridium, uranium, uh, methane cartridge. Now zeolite is interesting because I think I thought zeolite was a limited resource. I don't think zeolite can be um, can be mined. It grows on plants. So actually, I just want to pop up over here real quick. Uh, I want to go up this vine because there used to be a bunch of zeolite up there. And I'm actually thinking about possibly trying to throw a miner down and seeing if zeolite is mineable. I don't think it is, though. Uh, because there used to be a bunch of zeolite. Wow, it's really orange up here. And there's these carnivorous plants everywhere. Um, but there used to be zeolite up here. And I just don't think it's a mineable resource. Look at there's my base. Oh, I love it. I don't think it's a mineable resource. We'll try that out later. But today we are going to focus on fish because in about any minute now, we should unlock the fish and was it, did it say plankton or something like that? Plankton and, and fish. Look at those. Na those are nasty. I'm sorry. Like I, I understand these are the most oxygen producing things, but those look disgusting. <laughs> they're like very alien. I was thinking they're going to look like bonsai trees. Like have like the flat bonsai juniper topping on it. Nope. It's a mushroom. <laughs> But, you know, they always say mushrooms are like really good and stuff. Um, okay, so let's see here. 153, we are almost at 155. So the photoplankton and fish eggs, depending on its location, that is what we are going to try to collect today. And that's what we're going to be playing with. So we've got a whole one thing left to go. So we'll have that here any moment. But yes, thanks again for coming out. I really got to say, I appreciate all the support on absolutely everything lately. Um, it has been a really slow time on YouTube, but that's just kind of how it is. You know, summer is coming upon us. Spring's coming upon us. Things are getting nice. People are going outside doing stuff. So, um, yeah, but uh, I do appreciate any likes, subscribes, all the fun things. If you want to follow on Twitter, you can. If you want to follow on the Discord, you can. I love chatting it up. And uh, we're going to be streaming over on Twitch again here soon, as soon as my internet gets gets installed. I don't have a good enough internet right now to stream over on Twitch, unfortunately. I don't have a good enough internet to stream, period. Um, but hopefully that will be changing soon, so we'll be able to do some live streaming again. But, yeah, uh, let's see. We're, we're almost there. Like, I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. Uh... Where is it at? Right here. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it's coming. It's happening. It's gonna happen. Let's see. All right. What are we get? What are we gonna need to build this? Um, I don't know. Let's see. Come on. We're probably gonna need. Oh, I just used all my circuit boards. Probably gonna need a circuit board. I bet you anything we're gonna need a circuit board. <laughs> um, and there it is. Okay. So what do we need for this bad boy? Bioplastic nugget silk. Oh shoot. I'm not making silk. Um, I have it automatic. Oh, actually, it's going there. Okay, so let's grab those. Grab those. Um, let's see. So silk, we've got that. Bioplastic nuggets. Do I actually have any bioplastic nuggets already? Uh, bio nugs. Oh, we've already got some. We're good. And super alloy. I have two. Okay, I think we can build two of these. So let's go out here to our pond. So this pond right here is absolutely going to be where I want to do uh, all the fish things if I can. So let's put that there. Now, what does this do? What it, eh. Um, open water. Use it in the incubator to create fish. Photoplankton A. Okay, so we have one there. Hold on. So photoplankton A. Um, that makes me think that there's more, more types of photoplankton. So let's go try. Let's put some photoplankton. Do we want to put it in this pond? If this little pond right here or we've got let's go over here let's go to this one this one's more of a, a tropical area if you will we'll put it over here and we'll see if we get any other types of photoplankton and then we can mix and match and then we can mix fish and match fish and like do all kinds of fun fish stuff uh okay you know what's funny is i actually really like fish fish are really fun okay so let's see what we got here and it's still photoplankton a um i want to see if i can get something else other than photoplankton a out of there now we might not be able to i might not be able to that's that might not even change it might not change anywhere i go but i'm gonna go try a few different water sources and if i come up with something else i'll let you know see there's the zeolite right there i just don't feel like this is a mineable resource 
I don't know. We'll have to try that. We'll, we'll have to try it out at some point. Okay, this is a super tropical area. <laughs> Let's see if we get anything here. No. <laughs> Darn it. I don't think we're... I think maybe Photoplankton A is the only plankton we can get right now. Uh, it says it depends on where you put it, though. Hmm. Should I try it in this hole right here? Yeah, Photoplankton A still. Uh, there's a satellite down here. It's kind of interesting that this hole filled up with water. Oh, what about underground? That um, that pink area that has all those uh, the pink um, larvas. I wonder. Oh, you know, what I just realized actually while we're over here. Hold on a second. This is our uranium spot and I need to put a uranium tier three in, or a tier three uranium collector in here. Um, hello. Let's go ahead and select this to do uranium. Uh, we probably should have it selected to do everything too. Yeah, I forgot. We might need to get that uranium thing going too. There's a lot of uranium laying around too. Okay, sorry. Sidetracked. Whoa. Where does this cave go? How come I don't remember this cave? What? What cave is this? I don't remember this cave at all. There's more osmium here. Oh, this goes over into the uh, the spikes biome, doesn't it? Yeah, okay. All right, we know which one that is. Sorry. I got excited for now. I was like, wait a second. What is this? <laughs> uh, this is not the area I want to check. I want to check the underwater area or the underground area. I'm going to check the water in there. Maybe we can get a different type of... Um... Well, it wouldn't be photoplankton because it's underground. Whoa. I just realized the little stars above us. That's super cool. There's pulsar quartz right here. What? Hold on a second. Now I want to know. Like, I wonder if I set a mine up over here. Is Pulsar Quartz something we could mine now? There's Osmium up here too. Wild. Okay, so remember when I said like this feels like a, a place for fish? This feels like a place for fish. Still photoplankton A. Okay, hold on. Let's go check this over here. Let's go, um, maybe the back side of this waterfall. Okay, so let's try this water area. Photoplankton A. <laughs> We're not done yet trying. Oh. Look at all these, like, weeds and stuff. That's super cool. Can we place it down in here? Photoplankton A. I think Photoplankton A is all we get right now. I don't think I don't think we have a choice. Uh, you know, this this bridge bed right here is quite interesting. No, we can't place it on there. Okay, Photoplankton A. Everything's Photoplankton A. Let's go underground and check that one. I have a feeling it's gonna be Photoplankton A though. Oh, those trees that we made are the same ones from down here. Very interesting. Okay, what do we got here? Photoplankton A. Okay. <laughs> I don't think there's any other photoplankton right now. I think that might just be the only one we get for now. I just deconstructed that by accident. Okay. So yeah, that's uh that's my bad. My bad. Um I don't think there's anything else. So let's go ahead and let's just head back. Let's see if our other our first one caught anything and what we can do with it. Oh, I'm excited to start manipulating some fish. We're gonna manipulate the fish and make the most beautiful fish we've ever seen. All right, so let's go see photoplankton over here. <gasps> There's a whole bunch. I thought it was just collecting one thing. It's not collecting one thing. It's collecting a bunch of things. Oh my gosh. Okay, we got a whole bunch of things to play with. All right, all right, all right. Everybody calm down, calm down. So we've got photoplankton C. Uh, fish provost eggs, uh, photoplankton A, 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 B, C, and B. Okay, so what do I do in here? So if I put those in there, so those, those go in there. Uh-huh. 
But that's it? Use it in an incubator to create fish. How do I know? Oh, these are aquariums. Those aren't incubators. Wait a second. What's an incubator? Do I have an incubator? Oh, don't tell me I don't have an incubator yet. Oh, I do. It's the uh, the butterfly incubator. Open incubator. Show DNA recipes. Fish crom eggs. Photoplankton B. Open incubator. Does that research anything? No match. No match. Okay, so hold on a second. So what we know for fish eggs is it requires mutagen three and fertilizer. Um, mutagen three. So mutagen three. Bacteria, nitrogen, sulfur. That's easy enough. Okay, so let's go. Let's work on this. Let's let me work on that. Um, I'm gonna get these, and then we're gonna try different different eggs here because. If this requires mutagen three and fertilizer and a photoplankton B, that makes me think that we could do uh, the same thing with A and C. So I need three mutagen and um, three mutagen type. So, you know, what? I'm just going to go ahead. I'm going to throw these in there for now, just so that way they're all stored. Photoplankton A, B, and then C. Yeah. Okay, cool. This will work. Um, and I'm hungry. You know, I thought I had bacteria samples being made somewhere. Do I not have bacteria samples being made? Oh, yeah, look at that. Perfect. Okay, so that's going to give us the mutagen tier uh, three. So we're going to get three of those going. And then I'm going to need a uh, fertilizer. It said fertilizer tier one, I think. So let's get some fertilizer, one, two, three. And then let's go ahead and grab our photoplankton A, B, and C. And then it said one of these was a guarantee. So B will work. So let's go ahead and do B first. So let's get photoplankton B, mutagen, and fertilizer. Research. That's going to give us something. And then let's go into here and let's do uh, C, mutagen, fertilizer. That's going to give us something. So we'll let those do their researching. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. You know what's weird though is I put in that. And it's like researching it. So I guess maybe there's a chance. So there's a chance that maybe it can make this and there's a chance that it might make something else. That'd be kind of cool. And then, okay, so the aquarium is like the permanent storage for the fish. Okay. Oh, that means we need a big room for an aquarium. And what do we got? Okay, so fish crom eggs. We've got that. And then let's go ahead and let's do another um that one, that one, and that one. Research that. And what do we have over here? Uh golden fish eggs. We got golden fish eggs. Are you kidding me? Now does it say on here? No. So golden fish eggs was okay, hold on. Uh one of these was A and one of these was this was A. Uh, we did we did the crumb here, so we did B. So C, that gave us golden fish eggs. Are you kidding me? Let's put the golden fish in here. Golden fish. Are you kidding me? And then let's put the uh, crom eggs in here too. <gasps> oh, we need a room. Hold on. We we got we're gonna need a bigger room for this. <laughs> like this is this is not gonna work. We need a bigger room for sure. Uh, let's go with a big living compartment, three iron, free titanium, and two. Uh, okay. Okay, you have no you have no idea how excited I am about this uh, these aquariums. <laughs> I'm so excited about the aquarium. Um, you know what I'm actually thinking about doing is extending. I'm actually, thinking about extending this part of our base. Um, I'd have to move my drone hub though, and I don't know how that works. How does it work if I? Did my drones sit in here? So like, would I have to take my drones out? And I'm not actually sure how that works. Cause like, I need my, cause I, I kind of want to move this. You know what? Let's do this first. Let's just, let's expand this. Um, can I go on another one or probably not?
We definitely need more room here. Maybe I should just expand out this way. You know what? Let's just expand out that way. It's fine. We'll, fi <laughs> we'll figure it out later. All right, we're gonna have an aquarium room uh, in here. So let's go ahead and throw our golden fish in there. Throw these in there. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. I don't know if actually another aquarium will fit over there. Okay. So we've got those going. Let's go check on our other thing. Um, see what it came up with. Did we not hit research? Let's not hit research on it. Okay. So let's leave it do its thing. And let's go see what we got outside. I need more aquariums though. Because these are producing. So this produces. Does it tell me? Energy. It produces 20 grams per second for animals. And that is another biomass thing. So let's see what we have in here now. So B, C, A. So I think it was the... Did we decide if it was C? And also my next question is, how do we release fish into the water? <gasps> you know what? I bet you there's some kind of fish farm, isn't there? I bet there's some kind of fish. So we've got an aquarium, butterfly, and fish display, insert a fish egg to see the display. Wait, how did they get them in the water though? Hmm. You know what? I'm curious. Because in the images, it shows the actually it actually shows the aquariums like really close to the uh, to the water. Oh god, all these inventories are full. It's almost like somebody's automatically sorting stuff for me. Let's throw all these in here. And I want to take some iron. And I want to try something here. Okay, so we have this area down here. And then what I was thinking is we could actually throw the aquariums. If we throw an aquarium out here, like maybe like one per platform, you know, kind of thing. What does that do? Because I this is how they were on like the video, but I don't think that causes them to go into the water, does it? No. Okay, that doesn't cause them to go in the water. How do we get them in the water? <laughs> I want to know how to get them into the water here. I feel like there's got to be some kind of like fish farm thing. <gasps> you know what? I wonder if the upgraded aquarium generates animals no there's definitely a fish farm somewhere oh it's right here fish farm generates animals unlocked at 5.5 tons um okay so i guess we gotta wait for that but that's okay because we have a bunch of animals we got stuff going so all i need to do is basically make a bunch of aquariums uh that's not hard that's not hard at all we just need to uh i probably should go out and scavenge for some more uh some more things we need to probably expand this out i don't really need that there um kind of need to expand this out a little bit and then we can have more aquariums out here and then i probably should actually move these closer to here We actually need an incubator too, honestly. We need a whole incubator system out here so we can just get everything going uh, and do what we need to do. So let's go ahead and let's go. What do I want to do here? Do we need more? Uh, we honestly need more aquariums. So let's do this. Let's drop our inventory. Let's dump our inventory. And then let's go and grab. Let's go see if we can find some more. Um, some more circuit boards. I think that'll be that'll be handy. You know, do we need to take water? No, there's water everywhere. You know what? Let's go to this big one over here. You know what? Oh, hold on. Let's take a fusion reactor with us. And let's see what's behind the secret doors. Or maybe we should do that another time. You know what? Let's do that another time. Let's save that for a whole episode. We'll go we'll go through and we'll try to do all of them because I'm pretty sure there's there's three or four uh different ships with fusion reactors. So 
we'll leave those for for another time um we'll go get uh, we're gonna focus on fish like i said we're gonna focus on fish this time all right so we got um we got one two three four we got eight chips from that one not bad let's see where's the next wreck at there's another wreck oh we've got that wreck over there we have a small one over there i think that one might have some stuff in it. we'll go check that one out okay so we got a station here now i'm hoping that there's um there's there's uh server racks in here i'm not 100 percent sure though oh it's underwater now i mean that makes sense because it wasn't before but then this whole lake filled with water so i mean i guess i i mean it makes sense that it's all full of water now oh man that almost makes it creepier to check oh yes give me those chips please uh, do we already read this message today was the inaugural inauguration of the space warp gate it took two years oh that's right yes we already did read this okay yeah because this was a warp gate and then it crashed uh to the ground so yep there's another core there so there is three and like i said we will go through and we'll make a whole uh we'll make a whole video on checking those out but for now i just want to explore these i want to get some chips i want to get the fish going huh <laughs> fish and chips that's what it is oh yeah because then there's this like super secret underground cave area yeah last time we were in here we walked this and then there was um i think there's some chests and stuff in here that's kind of funny now we're swimming it actually i didn't even look up was there a way to go up i don't think so huh very very whoa hold on it said deacon it said something Oh, it probably said drink water, huh? Wait, deconstruct wreck. Huh. Must be something on the other side of that door. Maybe we'll find out in the episode when we open those fusion reactors up. I don't know. Oh, I can't drink this water. water filter on uh hello uh, i can't drink that water either <laughs> what's going on here maybe it's because my flashlight's on let me go check this water oh now it gives me the option i don't know weird okay so we are back in our base now what we're gonna do is i am gonna fill this room out right here with aquariums because uh we're gonna have indoor aquariums and then once we get fish farms we'll put them outside so let's see what we need for aquariums i know i needed the uh, the circuit board so i need fertilizer tier 2 oxygen capsule and super alloy so let's actually go check on the fertilizer tier 2. pretty sure we have that being automated oh except for mutal mutagen tier two for tier two. Oh yeah we have a lot okay so one two three four we'll get five uh we'll shoot for five of them and then five oxygen and five super alloy and we should be good i think oxygen right here and then we'll go ahead and get five super alloy perfect so let's go ahead and get these set up here oh i might need to move some things here huh all right so there's those five um i wouldn't mind getting an incubator up here as well because we're going to be doing the the fish stuff up here anyway actually we'll go take one out of the butterfly area because we don't really need two of them back there um and i'm going to go ahead and grab these fish and i'm going to take them put them inside as well and we'll grab an incubator and then uh yeah we'll have a whole little we'll have a whole little fish room it's gonna be it's so cool i love it there's that one and then we'll go ahead and get one in here like that oh man this is beautiful all right so we'll throw a golden fish in there i guess we'll go ahead and try to throw each fish species uh in its own thing i don't know how many there are oh actually you know what there's 11 species of fish <laughs> so that means i guess i could have uh two per thing one two three four five six seven yeah we have two per thing and we'll leave i don't know oh if we could throw gold in with a lot of them that'd be great too so let me actually go and uh, oh we need to go check on our last fish type that we just made 
Uh, fish vin Vilness. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and take... Let's take that one out. Kind of opens up the space a little bit more. And then let's go ahead and put that one in here. Uh, let's see. Incubator. Put that right there. That works. Okay, so now what we need is... I need to move some of that stuff. It looks terrible, but that's fine. So we need... Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and, and review. Fertilizer and mutagen tier 3. Oh, I forgot this all connects now. Oh, that's actually super nice. All right, so let's see. I think we decided we got the gold one from the oh man, I really wish I knew how I did that. Um we knew that this one was B, so I thought we did was it A that and that research? I'm not even 100% sure to be honest. You know what, let's do that one and then we'll go do it back here and we'll do C on this one. So let's see, we've got C, that one, and that one. So we'll let that do its thing. Okay, and then we'll see how that goes. And then we've got enough for three. We've also got another, we got Vilnus, Vilnus eggs, which I don't think we had. We have Crom, Provis, Vilnus. So something new. Um, ooh, those are pretty. I mean, the golden ones are the most prettiest, but those ones are cool looking. I like those. I like the colors on the fins and everything. Very good looking. Okay. So I guess while we wait, we'll go ahead and uh, redo these screens. All right. So we got a screen there. We got a screen there. It's looking good. Uh, we need to eat some food here. And let's see what we got. We got Vilnus again. So Vilnus was A. So it might just be completely random, just like how the butterflies were. Uh, ooh, Booyu was 350. Okay, so let's just go ahead. Um, so that was A. So C, I feel like C is actually... Well, that's because we don't actually have very many C. So Photoplankton C seems to be the one that given us the best um, outcomes. Let's see, I had a thing full of... So yeah, let's let's drop A and B and let's try to stick with C. Cause it seems like C is the one giving us the best uh B A C. Okay, that's enough for now. So let's go ahead and start up another a C mutagen fertilizer research, and then we'll go ahead and do the same thing on the other one. C mutagen fertilizer research that okay so we've got uh we got some more eggs let's go ahead and throw those into some tanks now i really want to have like like i said i want to have one of each type but i you know in the beginning we need just basically what we can get so we'll throw the vilnesses together the boo boo you oh those are like discus those are cool looking and then what is this provost is are these provosts Crom, Provost. So we'll throw the Provost together. Ooh, those are cool. I like these. Now, I'd like to get one of each type. But I mean, realistically, we need the most. We need the most bang for our buck here. <laughs> like, that's honestly what we really need. So it is what it is. Um, Look at the animals flying now. So do we have a rocket for animals yet? I don't think we do. Gives global generation bonus by spreading insects from outer space. Inspect spreader rocket. I mean, that might, that might do, um, maybe animals or I have a feeling. Well, no, isn't there one that already does insect rates? I don't know. Um, I want this aquarium though. I really, really want that aquarium. Like that's like the goal right now. So, um, I really need to get all of these things going and like upgraded and we got to do what we got to do. All right. What do we got here? Golden. Yes. All right, we'll throw the golden in here. So yeah, C mutagen and fertilizer. That is definitely the um, the way to go. The A's and B's are kind of like me, but if you want to collect all of them, <laughs> more golden. Yes. C for oh, I need more mutagen. Let me go make one more mutagen. <gasps> oh, look at that.
Uh, Ulani eggs. So, actually, we're probably gonna need two of those. So, that's a new, uh, that's a new egg type that we can make. That's exciting. So, I'm gonna go ahead and just throw, um, C... Oh, hold on. Wait, I didn't make, I didn't make the mutagen. Uh, mutagen tier three. And then we'll throw in the C mutagen fertilizer research and that sequencing fantastic okay so what is the new you the i don't even know what it was called um oh is that another golden fish oh my gosh the ulani see that's only a 250 but that's a c okay see it's photoplankton photoplankton mutagen and fertilizer i'm getting much better things than that that's crazy all right, let's go ahead and uh, throw that one in there. You know what? Let's throw this one in here. Let's just get some fish in all the tanks to start with. This is so exciting. I love the fish. The fish are so much fun. All right, are you done? No, not quite. But it says there's 11 different types of fish. Now, I think there's actually a... Do we have the fish display yet? No. Doesn't look like it. So it looks like it. I think there's a display for the fish too. So we can put a display up kind of like how we have all the different butterflies. Um, oh, we got the, the got the Ulani or Yulani or Ulani or Yulani. I don't know. Whatever. It is what it is. So we'll go ahead and throw those in. Actually, let's throw those in here. What do those ones look like? Oh, those are cool too. So we got a whole bunch of fish. Um, animals should be going oh yeah look at that very nicely very very nicely indeed so i like that that i mean animals is going to help us overall but still we need like a lot because for animals to get like the fish farm we need 5.5 tons that's gonna be that's gonna take a little bit so we definitely need to get some more um so let's see, we got two fish, we got two, 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 two. I honestly, I just need as many golden fish as possible. And I need a bunch of mutagen tier three. And it's it's really easy to make actually because the mutagen tier three requires um, all of this. So if I take all of those and then it just requires that, the, um, the nitrogen and sulfur. I don't know, I keep walking around. So these, nitrogen and then sulfur, it's super easy to make. Nitrogen, however, is appearing to be a little bit of an issue. So we might need to, um, might need to see what's going on with that. Is there something, maybe something's full on it and it's not producing enough. Maybe we need another one. Oh yeah, methane must be full. So I bet you the methane is completely full. Yeah, yep, that's the issue, okay. You know, I'm just going to throw this into the uh, El Removo. We'll throw that in there. Pop, it's gone. All right, I'm running out of fertilizer now, though. That's <laughs> a problem. Oh, darn it. Um, yeah, we need to... Uh, I really need to probably set up the... Uh, no, I need to I need to get in here. Uh, photoplankton. Oh, we got more fish provost eggs. C, I need that C type. I, I think we need to, um, we're really going to have to come through and set up some automation here for the, uh, for whatever we can, honestly, but mainly I'd really like to get the things I'd like to get automated. I'd like to get bacteria automated. Um, and then the fertilizers because we're using those a lot. And honestly, if I could get mutagen one, two, and three, um, and maybe even pulsar course, like if we could get all those automated, that would be sweet. So yeah let's go ahead and make another fish <laughs> so we got the C, the mutagen and the fertilizer so we'll let that do its thing we need more fish all the fish we need the fish so i mean we're getting yeah it's still taking a while we need that 5.5 so we can get the fish farm because the fish farm, uh, I believe what you do is you set it out here, you put the fish in it, and then the fish actually swim around in the pond. So that's what I want. I want them to actually be loose and wild. Wow, I got a little framey there for a minute. All right, let's see. And ah, the Yulani eggs. Darn it. You know, I have a feeling we got lucky with the golden 
because we didn't have these ones unlocked yet. So it's like, oh, I can't give you anything else. So I'm going to have to give you the golden fish. <laughs> Darn it. I should have made as many as I could off the beginning. Maybe not. I don't know. I just feel like the golden fish are probably going to be a little bit more rare now. Uh, but there we go. We have it. We've got animals going. We've got actually this is about to roll over to. Is it going to be one ton? One T? Maybe. Oh, nope. It's going to be a fast right. It's going to go kilograms in a thousand. Then, okay. Yeah, we're way off. We are so far off from making the, from getting the fish farm. Oh, we're going to have so many aquariums. It's going to be a great time. But that is going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Um, again, do appreciate all the support. You have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. What do you think of Planet Crafter? Leave a comment down below, down below and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.